Ladies and gentlemen, today we are going to dive into the world of the renowned artist, Georges Seurat. Seurat was a French painter who lived in the late 19th century. His unique style and approach to art became a key contributor to the development of the pointillist movement. Seurat's life experiences greatly influenced his artistic journey. As a young man, he would often visit the countryside, spending time along the River Seine, observing the beautiful landscapes and scenes that surrounded him. These experiences would later find their way into his paintings, bringing them to life with vibrant colors and detailed brushwork. Let's take a closer look at some of Surat's notable works during this period. First, we have the channel at Gravelines from 1890. In this painting, Surat captures the serenity of the water, showcasing his keen eye for detail and his ability to harmonize colors. The calmness of the scene reflects his desire to evoke a sense of tranquility and peace. Moving on, we have study for bathers at Asnières from 1883 to 1884. Surat's exploration of the human figure in this piece is remarkable. His meticulous observation and attention to detail allow us to see the various emotions and interactions among the bathers. It is through these studies that Surat began to experiment with the use of dots and dots of color, laying the foundation for his future artistic style. Another painting worth mentioning is the Seine with clothing on the bank, study for bathers at Asnières. Here, Surat reveals his dedication to capturing scenes in their natural environment. The carefully chosen colors and the play of light and shadow give life to the river bank, inviting us to immerse ourselves in the scene. As we explore further, we come across moored boats and trees from 1890. This painting showcases Surat's ability to depict both the stillness of nature and the movement of water. The detailed brushwork and carefully placed dots bring out the texture and depth of the boats and trees, allowing us to feel the tranquility of the scene. Moving on, we have study for a Sunday on La Grande Jatte from 1884 to 1885. This is perhaps one of Surat's most famous works. Here, he masterfully combines his meticulous dot technique and his understanding of composition to create a rich and vibrant scene. As we look closely, we can appreciate the incredible amount of effort Surat put into each individual dot, bringing the entire painting to life. Looking at the channel of Gravelines Grand Fort Philippe from 1890, we see Surat's fascination with maritime scenes. His attention to detail and his use of color create a sense of movement, making us feel as though we are standing on the edge of the water, witnessing the boats sailing away. One cannot overlook Grand Camp, evening from 1885. In this painting, Surat captures the beauty of the setting sun and its reflection on the water. The harmonious blend of colors and the delicate brushwork transport us to the calmness of the seashore, allowing us to appreciate the serene atmosphere he was able to convey. As we come to the end of our journey, we encounter the channel at Gravelines, evening from 1890. This painting perfectly encapsulates Surat's ability to capture the fleeting moments of the changing light at dusk. The blend of warm and cool colors creates an atmosphere that is both captivating and peaceful. Lastly, we have the circus from 1891. In this remarkable piece, Surat captures the energy and excitement of the circus. The use of bold colors and strong geometric shapes add to the dynamic nature of the scene, drawing us in and making us feel as though we are right there in the audience. Georges Surat's life experiences and observations enabled him to create works of art that continue to captivate and inspire us to this day. Through his meticulous attention to detail, his use of color, and his innovative dot technique, he was able to breathe life into each painting, transporting us to the very moments he captured. Today, we celebrate Georges Surat and the rich legacy he left behind.